Hello and welcome to this edition of Fiery Friday. I'm Rob Lienti, Senior Sales Development Manager for EFI's Fiery Business Unit. And today I'm going to show you how to create automated workflows using Fiery VDP imposition and server preset templates. So in last week's Fiery Friday, I showed you how you can make numbered tickets using Freeform Create, how you can then send those jobs over to the Fiery and apply server presets to those jobs. So when the job is completed, the imposition is done and the tickets are in the proper order. Now I'm going to show you how to create those imposition templates and server presets. So with Command Workstation open, we have the ticket job that I've sent over from Freeform Create. Now this is not imposed yet, so the first thing we want to do is we want to create the VDP imposition template. So we're going to do a right click on the job, select impose, and impose opens. So from here you can see there is our ticket showing the record and the page of that VDP job. We're going to go over to Sheet and select 13 by 19. Then what I want to do is I want to come up to where it says Normal and do Gang Up. And then I have an option. I can do a multi-record collate or a cut and stack. In this example, we're going to do a multi-record collate, and you'll see what happens. So here you can see there's record one, record two. It's laying it out side by side. We'll make this three over two, and now you're going to see it's record one, two, three, four, five, six. So that's how it's laid out. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to add a gutter. We'll add an eighth inch all the way around, and then we'll add trim marks to the imposition template. So once it's set up, ready to go, we're going to come up here and save this as VDP tickets. Then we'll click OK, and then close this out without saving the job. So now the first part's done. We've created the imposition template. Now what we want to do is create the server preset. So to do that, we're going to do a right click on that same job, go into our job properties, First, we're going to select the paper catalog media we want to use, which is going to set our paper size as well as our media weight. Then we're going to go to the layout section, select impose, and from our imposition templates, you're going to see there's VDP tickets. So the last thing we do is we come up to presets, and we're going to save this as a server preset, and we're going to name this the same thing, VDP tickets. So now we've got the second part done, and we'll hit Cancel again. So now we've got it all together. We could do a right-click on this job, and you can see we have an option here for VDP tickets as a workflow. Or if we open up Freeform Create, then go up and hit Send to Fiery Server, you'll notice that the server preset that we created on the Fiery is now listed underneath Settings. So when we click that and hit process and hold, it'll send that job over to the Fiery. And after it's done processing and holding that job, we can take a look at the finished result. So with the preview open of the job, you'll notice that the tickets are laid out in the proper sequential order. So this is a perfect example of automation using the tools that are available on the Fiery using server presets and using Fiery imposition templates. With automation being a hot topic in the print industry, I encourage you to download EFI's newest ebook, Automation Building Blocks Six Easy Ways to Streamline Your Production Print. Uh, in our free ebook, we identify six easy ways you can add automation to your printing workflow with the tools you currently have on your Fiery servers. So, again, go download that at the link below. I want to thank you again for joining me for this edition of Fiery Friday. If you have any questions about the video you saw today, please feel free to reach out to me at rob.lienti at efi.com or message me on LinkedIn. Have a great weekend.